Hello everyone, today we are going to study what Joule's law of heating effect. As we know that uh, when there is a current flow through in an electric heater, then the rod of the heater glows and produces heat. This effect is also same in case of uh, electric wall, when current flow through the coils of the wall, then the walls glow and uh, it radiates heat. In the nutshell, we can say that if uh, there is a current flow through the conductor, then heat is uh, produced. For this Joule given law that is known as the Joule law of uh, heating effect of electric current. Suppose this is a conductor and uh, let V be the potential difference lies across the end of the conductor. Suppose in this uh, conductor I V the current flowing through in it and uh, R V the resistance of this conductor and the current flow for a uh, time t. Then according to Joule heat produced in this conductor that is energy directly proportional to current k square and uh, also heat directly proportional to resistance of the conductor and uh, also heat produced directly proportional to time. So by combining these we get H directly proportional to I square RT. To remove this constant of proportionality we take a constant and in SI system the value of constant of proportionality is 1. So here we get a relation H is equal to I square RT. Means when there is a current flow through in a conductor, heat is produced, then according to Joule, that amount of heat produced equal to current cus here, multiply resistance, multiply time. So in this way, we calculate heat produced in the conductor. If we know about a current, a resistance and time for which uh, the current flow through in a conductor, we are able to find the heat produced in the conductor.